Come on in, hustlers, to the movie. Come on in, y'all, because I'm coming in with y'all. And I'm kind of excited. <laughs> hey, hey. Come on in, y'all. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Hey, hey. Come on in here, y'all. Bring your Kool-Aid, your cocktail, your water. Bring your food and snacks to sit and chat with who? Me. This hood girl to the hood. Mm-hmm. It's hump day. Hey, now. Y'all, it is the last of the chicken from Sunday's dinner. And, of course, you know, every time I have a, at least one piece of meat, I got to compare it to what? Those spicy noodles that I like. Y'all, we are now in the middle of uh, December. So, this is scene one, take one. Let's roll the tape. Hey, y'all. I hope your week is going good. Thank y'all so much for coming back. And thank y'all for looking at the last video that I posted. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Thumbs me up. And like me, if you will. Let's say press. Thank you, God, for this another day. Thank you for helping me do a good job for AA. My God, have your way. You are so awesome to me and my family. Yeah. Those who are looking at me right now, bless them according to your will, your way, your purpose, your love, your favor, oh, and your grace, God. Yeah. Mm. My God, my God. Thank you. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. And amen. Y'all, sometimes I pray I, that the Holy Spirit is always alive in me, and I thank God for it. So, y'all, look here. Let's toast. Humday, um, humday uh, cocktail. Just one. Cheers. Uh, this is for a good night on humday. Hmm. <laughs> Going on over to Thursday. Uh huh. That's the pre weekend. So. Salut, salut. Let's sip, sip this good hood stuff. Cheers, y'all. Cheers. Mm-hmm. That's good. That's that leftover chicken, y'all. You know that some other chicken that I did? That's the only piece we have. Because I, I didn't do a whole lot of rice and corn, so it didn't last. That's hot. Y'all know these two spicy noodles, right? So let's do this. Oh, it's still hot. Yum, yum. Give me some. Ooh, y'all, that bowl is still hot. Ooh. Oh, y'all, without a do, let's dig in. Let's cut this. Uh. <sighs> okay, y'all. Y'all know last week, y'all, I put some of this uh, gravy on this noodles. <laughs> I hope it tastes good. Uh, y'all know last week I didn't have no work, just a little training. Uh, Monday, uh, no work, just training. I got work on yesterday, which was Tuesday. Um, I was a little confused because, you know, it was the first day. And um, I had 11 wrecks to create for recall people uh, from uh, American Airlines. Here you go. Yum, yum. Give me some. So I had 11 wrecks. And uh, I had to do, I, 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 you know, I told her, I said, look, I'm, I'm a bit confused. I need you to come back and walk walk through me, walk with me through this wreck. So she said, okay. And so she did one wreck. No, I'm lying. She walked uh, two. She did two with me. And so I, then I got it, right? Mmm. Mmm. Thank God. Hot. God damn it. Oh. Mmm. Oh. Y'all, I knew better. That gravy in here is good. Mm-hmm. It's really good. Y'all got something on my mind. So, y'all, look here. Um, 
I went through them and so after I got through, I realized that I probably had made two mistakes out of 11 wrecks. So that's not bad for the first day. So I reached out to her. I said, I think I made a mistake. Uh, you know, can't, how uh, do I go back in and edit? And so she said, uh, and I was already working overtime. And so she said that uh, uh, we'll do it today. You know, she said tomorrow, meaning today. And give me some rest and, you know, da-da-da, and thank you, da-da-da-da. And I was like, okay. So I clocked off. And so the first thing this morning, 8 o'clock uh, sharp, I, I saw her online. And I, 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 I told her, I said, look here, here I am. Uh, you know, what 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 can we do? Can you walk me through it again? Uh, she said, but they ha she had to uh, ask the leaders to um, back it out. So it came back to me really fast. And so... Uh, uh, I forgot to choose the recall letter thing. That was it. So, uh, she opened, she, she said, come on, uh, let's do it. Let's do a short video and, and you walk with me and show me what you're doing. And I did, she said, oh, wow, you did really good. Mm -hmm. So, mm, yeah. yeah. So, that was another training for me today for mail merge. Because, you know, you create the wreck. And then the, the talent acquisition people, they post it. And then we can now do letters. Uh, so she went through that with me today. But that was all that I had today. But the beautiful thing is y'all know... Y'all know that I always say whatever job you have, even if you don't like it, you have to apply your whole self and do the best that you can with it. So after that uh, training for the mail merge, she said, she called me Anita and she's from the Philippines. And you know, she had the accent. She said, Anita, uh, I want to thank you for being so proactive. You are so proactive and I thank you. And I said, well, thank you for being a great trainer. You know, just, you know, we, we even with no work because I kept asking her even on the week, you know, where's the work? Do we have any? What what should I do? We know, you know, what can I do? So she told me today that I was really proactive and she thought that was a beautiful thing, you know. So here again, y'all, this is not something I wanted to do, but I'm doing it. And I'm doing it good. So do it. Do it. Do it till you're satisfied, whatever it is. Ain't that a record? Mm hmm. An old school record, too. Mm hmm. So, mm. You guys know I thought about my chopsticks, and I was like, now nah, I'm hungry. So, y'all, you know, I felt really good about it. But I know tomorrow I'm going to have some work. But I also asked her, um, uh, am I, am do, you know, is Friday really my last day? She said, yeah, if all the 3,000 letters go out, it is, it is going to be my last day. I haven't had a word from the interview I had for the HR uh, operations specialist. I did reach out to uh, my interviewer, and he said he was going to a meeting in, with the TM, and so he can confirm some things. So, I don't know. I guess I won't know until he come back to me. Mm -hmm. But I, t I asked him if he would, you know, whether I got it or not, if he would just, you know, tell me. So, we'll see. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. So, that's where we at, y'all. Cheers. Mm -hmm. You know, one thing I will say, that IBM is really a good company. It really is. Mm-hmm. So, so, you know, that's what it is, y'all.
That's my best friend calling y'all. I'm just gonna have to call her back. I'm gonna have to call her back. I'm gonna have to call her back. I got seven minutes, y'all. So, yeah, that's what it is, y'all. My blood pressure is doing good too, y'all. Mmm. You know, normally I do my my laundry on Saturdays. Well, I did my laundry today. I ain't had nothing else to do. So I was proactive in my house. I need to uh, dust my bar. I need to dust my bar off. Y'all, we are almost uh, at Christmas Day, Christ's birthday, y'all. Y'all ready to celebrate him? Mm hmm I am. I think my sister excited that I'm coming to spend the night on Christmas Eve. Mm-hmm. I probably will do a video with her. Well, not with her, at her house. Mm -hmm. The last time I was there, I did a video, and they was whispering. I said, baby, y'all don't have to whisper. Shoot. We talk. If we talking about something, shoot, we can chit-chat. Not no problem. Y'all want some of that chicken? You know, I was waiting for it to cool off, because I already had burnt my mouth with these darn noodles, y'all. This is good. My only last piece too, y'all. I am really happy. I know God is working on me. Mm -hmm. I know He is. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. This is so good with that juice in it, y'all. Y'all know Kicker the Lynn is now monetized, y'all. So don't forget to congratulate her. And you know, I tell you, my my numbers fluctuate every week, you know. I'm stuck in the la in the in the last in the the last or the later of the four hundreds. You know, I'm stuck. I go to 495, then 491, then 493, then 492, now 491, and nah, nah, nah. <laughs> Really, people? Mm. But I'm, I think I'm going to stick and stay, at least with the cigars. A hookah. Y'all, it's cold here in Texas now. Well, I know some of y'all have snow, but <laughs> I'm not complaining, but it's cold. You know, we're not used to that cold here. So, it's like in the lower 40s. I walked on that patio. I said, whoop! <laughs> Came my butt right back in this house. Oh, y'all, uh, if you haven't seen my last video about uh, our black brothers and why they feel they can't date us anymore. Um, I wasn't finished because I ran out of time, but go see that video. It was posted today, uh, Wednesday, the 16th. I think today is the 16th. Yeah. So this is just a, a continuation of it. Because I look, I look at it all the time. And, um, you know, I, I'll say it again. I want them to not give up on us because some of them that were saying what they said, they did it to somebody, you know. And then the question was, were you not in the house when your mama was hurt? Did, did you feel some kind of way? Were you angry? And they said, yeah, well, why can't a, a black woman be angry when you are angry? Why? I mean, I know we, we are more emotional than men, and we hold on to the angle longer than we should. 
And I think sometimes when we hold on to that anger, we didn't forgive. And that's one thing God taught me a long time ago. He taught me how to love and forgive. You know, that's why I can uh, do what I do with my own mother. You know, I had to go and forgive her. And when you forgive, you forget, you let it go. Excuse me. But I think a lot of women, because they saw it with somebody in their family, and then it happened to them, and they didn't let that go, so it just piled up on them, so now they really angry. So if I can say this to, to my sisters, my black sisters, yeah, we're angry at what men have done to us. But we have to let it go and move on. Sometimes you got to seek therapy. I don't mind doing therapy. You got to talk some things through. You got to talk it out. You got to heal. And let that anger go. Because a lot of times when we hold on to that anger and we can get a good man in our life and the first time of an of a, of a argument or a disagreement, it, it's just going to trigger that pain and it's just going to come out and you're going to make him pay for what you didn't let go a long time ago. Stop that. Really? You're going to damage your relationship and your marriage. Yeah, let it go. And then my black brothers. The ones who leaving us to be extinct like some animal or something on the other side of the world. Y'all gonna come back, you know, right? Uh-huh, you coming back. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm gonna say right now because I got another show to watch. Let me see what they saying now. So anyway, that was a mixer um, with black women and white women at the mixer with the black brothers just to see where they was going to congregate and who, with who. And of course, y'all already know. Mm -hmm. But I also, you know, some of them congregated with the Caucasian girls. I listened to some of us black women when they approached us and some things that I, I just think that in the first meeting you just shouldn't say. You know? So yeah, y'all, our time is up. I don't want no long video. But let's eat this fork of noodles. I've been eating them noodles more than that. Noodles good with that juice. More than that chicken, huh? But I'm going to finish this, though. For real, for real. So look here. Let's sing ourselves out. But before you leave, don't forget to thumbs me up and like my video. And those who came uh, new, don't forget to subscribe, okay? So look at y'all. Cheers. Let's sing ourselves out. It's time to say goodbye for now. We'll have another chance around on the other side. So whatever you do, whatever you do for this hump day night, do it good. Do it with purpose. And please do it with genuine love. Yeah. So I love you. Peace out.